what is up guys it's so ash welcome back we are back with a new game this is called crusaders of light it is being beta tested currently i believe in australia could be austria i'm not sure i haven't like decided on which one of those countries it is yet but it, it is in beta you can get the apk early if you would like to do so um i normally use the same one which is like apk pure or something like that just look it up you'll immediately be able to find it and download it but we're going to take a look at the characters of this game first. So you got warriors. All right. Okay. Look at you. All right. So you have a male version and a female version. Hello. How are you? All right. So at level 20 warriors can choose the path of the following executioner, gladiator, fangs of Titanus, debuff strength. There is some deep deep uh yeah involvement with this game and that's just a warrior so next is a ranger scout forest god animal tamer and let's check out the male version uh, not too too bad and the female hey girl that's not bad at all okay so that's two of the characters so far. Then we have mystics, which I'm assuming are mages. Verity spirit, which is a healing and uh, damage. Okay, so it's more of a healer type as well. Okay, cool. And look, there's a question mark for the next character. So that's, that's, that's pretty cool. They're already going to plan on adding more characters into it before it's even released. I do like that aspect of it. Uh, but for this, uh, let's go ahead and start with a ranger. I've already played a little bit of the warrior. Uh, so let's see what kind of awesome randomized name we can get. Fedor. All right, we are being Fedor today. Duplicate name. Okay, we can't use that. Lutz. Nope. Wise. Okay, so apparently all of these are duplicated names and we can't start this adventure yet. So, uh... Our name is going to be not a duplicate. Done. Yay, we got in. Your grandfather will finally retire this month and will return you. Okay. In my 15 years here, the demons have always remained behind the wall. So it will not be able to regulate your stories of heroic battles with demons. All right. General Darnstall. Desolation walls have been breached. The demons are here. That text went really, really fast. This is pretty dope so far, though. Uh, animations. Hey. This guy is pretty big. Um. This dude's bigger than the walls. What walls? Yeah. Okay. Right. So we're going to kill this dude. Tap for the quest guide. Attack. All right. So that's where we're going. So your quest are in the top. Gameplay. Let's see how it feels. It is 3D now. So you can look around. And being because I'm probably not playing this on the best device. So everything is not going to be turned up. So let's check out the next objective. Fairly large map just for a, a, a tutorial. Tap the guy to use the skills. All right. Auto attacks. Can't take a good bit to take some of the stuff down. Uh, I did see get a pretty good lag spike there. All right, this is part of the quest. You can always move yourself around. And now we got to follow this guy. He is uh, General Darnstaff. So let's go. What are we gonna fight? This is a pretty immersive. Uh, tutorial it has been quite a while since I did the tutorial because I believe it was a week or so ago when I first got this 
All right, we created a team. Awesome. So he's in my team. Let's go. So we have to purify these guys. Next. I want this one. And what? Three more. All right. So there's quests involved with this as well, which of course you would hope it would be. It's RPG, but that's pretty cool. So far the graphics, I mean, they're, they're nice for a mobile game. Everything's felt semi smooth. I mean, as far as the device goes, I mean, that can be accounted for. Now, I know some people aren't going to like that auto feature, but it's going to come in handy when, uh, when you get tired of the grind and it's a, it's a mobile RPG. So there's going to be some form of grind to it. All right, here's the balls. This guy's big. Let's get out of the bushes. Let's avoid this guy. Ouch. Avoid those red things. Stay out of that. We're good. We're good right here. I love Rangers. That's what they're good for. Nice. Ah, let's get out of that. Destroying this dude. So you can see he's up in there tanking. I saw the uh, chains. That's one of the, the tank abilities. I'll show you my warrior. I started playing uh, a week or so ago. I'll have to show you him in another video. But yeah, this game so far. Like is ridiculously very intriguing. Like it, it's going to be really, really fun when it's actually, you know, I can play it on my own servers here in the United States where it won't lag, but just the depth of this, the, the way it's teaching you how to do stuff, because that right there was somewhat similar to what you're going to find against probably dungeon bosses and stuff like that and possibly raid bosses. So being able to add different aspects. Oh, this person came out quick. Go ahead and drop some abilities. Oh, let's get out of there now. Nice. Next. Go ahead and destroy this person. We're going to hang back here in the back with this mage and uh, this warrior. I'm doing too much damage or something. That guy just teleported to me. It's a banshee. And if you hit the button up there, it'll auto attack and do everything for you. Uh, it won't move out of the way of these things. So that's the only thing, but let's go ahead and uh, navigate to the next one. Now the mini map, I could say the mini map, it could be a little bit better. Um, the detail of it's very sparse and it's just really kind of looks awkward. Just sitting up there by itself uh settings okay yeah we're getting a little bit of lag let's go in here i want to see the big raid type balls yulon all right what are we waiting for here we go. Cutscene. Yo, what's up? What is your name, girl? Jeez. I like somebody split you in half and put you back together. Let's kill her. All right. So you auto lock on the people. That's pretty cool. Let me get around behind the tank. Razor wind. Oh, that was cool. Get out of that. Rage on this guy is pretty decent as well. Whoa. What's happening? She just smushed us. Uh, we need to move out the way of that. 
Use this ability again. It seemed to do a pretty decent amount of damage. Yeah, 293. Now, I have no idea what these abilities do yet. We're almost dead. Would you prepare? Oh, my jeez. There's two more of them. The big ugly trios. Let me run. Let me run. Haha, I can run. This is, uh, it's getting a little sketchy. Uh oh. All right. So, do we survive this? Yo! Dude, just sacrifice yourself. What? Storylines already. Oh. Wasn't expecting that. Uh, yeah, we're just gonna go with smooth. Okay, let's go with that. All right, accept the quest. Now we're not a duplicate, okay? We 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 figured that out at the beginning. We're not a duplicate. All right, we'll accept this quest. We'll go to the next one. Let me look around the world, so. All right, we'll accept that. All right, we gotta kill these guys. Let's get down here where we can see stuff. All right, you have skills. Auto upgrade. So you upgrade skills by level. When you level up, you can upgrade your skill. That's pretty cool. And I seen there was going to be multiple skills on that as well. So except the next quest, a large calder crab shell. We'll just kill this one standard right there. Nice. All right. So obviously some quests you're going to have to run further than that. Or, I mean, I didn't really have to run anywhere at all, but are we going swimming? Oh, we're just filling this with water. I was going to say, are we swimming? Yeah, this is uh, definitely going to be a title I'm going to be playing when it is released. Extinguish the Flames. Because it's been a while since I've played a good RPG. I know I've been seeing a lot of your comments about Tai Chi Panda 3. I do have it. I was going to do a video on it today. But... The servers were down so i was not able to log in so i'm sorry about that but we are going to get to that i know some of you that have been around for quite a while have been waiting on something like that yeah so this is kind of a filler until then to see what we can see what we can actually find out about this game so we're still doing quests asking for information check out our bag all right so that's a lesser basic weapon okay complete that quest apparently we found out a lot of good information all right so basically your assets or your character strength that it's pretty much in this game decisions picking up leather boxes oh no I got hit now I'm pretty sure the uh, the moral of this story is get out of the way of the box before it blows up and I'm sure we can pass the quest so we immediately know to ran up oh, I guess uh, I guess that one did have some stuff in it didn't have to run from that one next quest let's go more chests to open a lot of quests involved in this game. Here we go. Demons have closely been watching Melora. Melora marches towards its fate. Child of Light holds the key to unlock new lives. 
prophet. I'm not saying that word. I can't pronounce it. I can already tell you that. So they have cutscenes in between some of these quests, which are pretty cool. So I like where they're going with the storyline aspect of this game as well. A lot of quests. Now I'm not reading all this stuff, of course, because that would take a lot of time. This video has already probably been pretty long as it is. Nice animations. And this is the, the map. That's what the map looks like. Cool. All right, now we can leave and explore. This looks pretty awesome. Um, there are things riding those things. Hold there. Oh, you want to fight? You say, hey. All right, let, let's move up here, back over here, so we can see. Hey, you, you hold this, buddy. Ha! All right, leather shoulder pads. We got some gear from that. Cool. Automatically equips it. And let's talk. Okay. They actually took the time to... Uh, Yep, we're getting a little lag. There we go. So they actually took the time to even put little small snippets like this into quest lines that are built into the storyline, which I like because they took into the fact to use the contrast from the background from the character in the front, so that's pretty cool. I like that. All right, here we go. Um, more quest. Let's go. Whistle. What are we whistling? Whoa. What? We got grass. Feed it some grass. What happened? Hey, they're riding those things. Except the quest. Ride the Hulk wheel. Nice. So you can peach in and zoom in and out. Oh, nice. Swipe to pan left and right, of course. This is absolutely awesome. So you get a mount this early in the game, a level eight, and I just got a mount. They want to immerse you into this game. And that's what they exactly what they have done already. That's awesome. All right. Dismount button is right there, right on the joystick. So it's not gawky and in the way feels right just barely tap it and it comes on this is an awesome game so far guys this is called crusaders of light if you didn't catch the name of it earlier this has been a very long video i'm sorry for it being this long but this game is pretty cool there's a lot to it because you see i just barely got to the tutorial it's gonna be an amazing game and when it does come out i'll let you guys know if you guys want to see more gameplay on this let me know in the comments below and i'll play it some more i'll play some of the other characters the warrior the uh, mystic and we'll see how they do and see what they're capable of doing. But that's going to be it for this video, guys. Make sure you leave a like down there because it does help us out a lot. Comment down below and let me know what other games you might want to see on the channel as well. And yeah, as always, guys, like, comment, and subscribe. I am Soulbash. You guys have a nice day.